of American Stars has come out to help Oprah Winfrey open her South African school for girls. More than 150 disadvantaged girls have won a place at the self-styled Leadership Academy. The talk show queen certainly knows how to put on a party. Among those joining her, Tina Turner, Mariah Carey, Mary J. Blige and Chris Rock. The top star though, Nelson Mandela, was kept away from the cameras. The school teach the South African curriculum from grade 7 through to grade 11, but it's operating independently from the Gauteng Education Department. This school is open to all girls who are disadvantaged. All girls, all races who are disadvantaged. Winfrey says she's also planning to buy a home close to the school and wants to set up another school for boys too this time in KwaZulu-Natal. A New Year's celebration is being blamed for a fire at an informal settlement that's left one person dead. Three other informal settlements also went up in flames on New Year's Day, resulting in the deaths of three more people. Hundreds of residents are now homeless. The fire at Dinoon flared up at night and spread quickly through the shacks. A 36-year-old man lost his life before help arrived. Firemen fought for hours to bring the flames under control. Witnesses claim the fire was started by a group of men celebrating New Year's Day, but this is yet to be confirmed by officials. More than 160 shacks were razed to the ground. And those left homeless are appealing to government for shelter. We always have this problem. And every day when we complain, we complain with the people who are like a municipality. They didn't know about us. I lost everything, everything, even my ID book. We lost everything. As I'm here standing here by now, I got nothing. <laughs> Three other fires swept through informal settlements in Kailicha and Guguletu early on New Year's Day. The Guguletu fire claimed the lives of two men and a woman. More than 200.